afternoon it's thursday look at the state of me not even dressed yet mommy's not even dressed yet and she's stinky she needs a bath <laughs> i do <laughs> today is a two upload day so i've been sitting here working on those since I got up this morning. It's already nearly 10 to two. Up we go, time for a bath then. Hello. Flies keep coming in and dying in my bath. So I need to rinse those out before I can run it. Hey, have you seen Izzy's herbs that she planted? Look, they need a bit of water perhaps. Uh, what are they? She did right on the thing, didn't she? Oh, basil. These two rows closest to basil. The other one's a coriander. They look like all the same. <laughs> I wonder if some basils have sneaked onto the coriander side. Look, it's pushed up the uh, the earth. Oops, it was on top. I wonder if I shouldn't have done that. Oh, well, I've done it now. Anyway, I'm going to rinse that bath out and run it and get in it. I have de -flied and I'm filling the bath up. It's not as warm today as it was yesterday, but it's still warm enough to keep the bathroom window open while I have a bath. I've had my bath now, I'm all clean. Ta-da! Clean top and everything. I'm going to sort out my messy kitchen and then I've got a really odds and endsy afternoon coming up. I have a list of things, little itty bitty things that I need to just get done. So I'll tell you what they are as I come to them. I started a new puzzle last night, first time in ages. I haven't been finishing editing early enough to start a puzzle. I haven't been finishing till like oh, 11 or 11.30 at night and it's a bit late for starting puzzles then so... I've just been watching a bit of other people's vlogs and then going to bed usually. But anyway, I did finish a bit earlier last night. Actually, that's not true at all. What happened was I slept for two and a half hours yesterday afternoon because I was feeling a bit weird. But I feel fine today, by the way. All better. It must have been hay fever or something. Anyway, I just stayed up late because I slept for two and a half hours in the afternoon. This one's got Morris dancers in it. Look, fiddle and accordion. That makes me feel at home, that does. That's like my normal life going to folk festivals and being among traditional dance and music. This is a set of four puzzles, I think, on this one, so I honed instantly <laughs> into that one. This is a Gibson's brand one, and um, the pieces are slightly funny shapes. Look, a little bit askew, would you say? You see, with the corner piece ones, they tend to line up, don't they? But as you can see with that one, it overlaps the little thing there but it's probably stronger once it's all together isn't it i don't know maybe but it's immo versus the washing up time now as you can see i took on the washing up and won well i've got my first admin task ticked off the list and the next thing is to find out what i've won i've won something apparently so I'm gonna look at the email and see what it is. I think I have a choice of a number of items and I'm not sure if I require any of them, to be honest, but I'm gonna go and see what there is. The next thing I'm sorting out is that slush puppy maker. I suddenly remembered about it. Do you remember I bought Izzy a slush puppy maker for Christmas and it was rubbish? And then about the third time we tried to use it, it actually broke. So I organized with Amazon to send it back, which I did, but I've just realized it's, it was May and I've heard nothing from them. So they haven't sent me the refund. So I need to look into that now and chase that up. Okay, now I've emailed them. I wonder what's on my list next. Mark Izzy's maths. I'm putting the kettle on for a cup of tea. This is turning into a very admin-y kind of day, really, pretty much. I'm still at it. It's like every time I send off an email to try and deal with something, another one comes back asking me to do something else to, oh, the slush puppy people got back to me very quickly. Pfew, like lightning they were. They wanted the receipt of postage because they said they never received the package. You saw the vlog, you saw me taking that slush puppy machine all the way to the post office, miles away. Uh, it never arrived apparently, but luckily I kept the receipt. Well, it wasn't luck. I fully intended to keep that receipt in case something like this happened. So they said if I sent them a photograph of that, they would refund the money. So I've sent that off. I need to pay some council tax as well. What else? Mark Izzy's, I still haven't marked Izzy's maths because these other emails started popping up. I had a, an inquiry for a gig as well, which I already have a booking that night. So I'm going to see if IB wants to put together a different lineup to do that. So I've been replying to them, sent an email to him. And now I'm making a cup of tea and then I'm just going to crack on with it. What I'm going to do is I'm going to ring one number that I need to get through on, but I know I'm going to be on hold for 
absolutely ages maybe like I think last time it was like something like 45 minutes and then in the end I just pressed a button to get a call back um, so I'm going to have that on hold at the side of me keeping an ear out for it while I'm marking Izzy's mouth and drinking a cup of tea so that's that's my plan yeah at some point I need to practice my flute for an hour but look at the time it's just these little jobs just seem to fritter away afternoons gonna make you all fancy a cup of tea now. <laughs> well those of you that like tea. Thankfully there isn't annoying hold music so I'm actually able to concentrate I think. <laughs> I'm rubbish at multitasking, I really am. If you would like an agent to call you back in the next two hours instead of continuing to hold please press one and you will be prompted to enter the number you wish to be called back on. If not please continue to hold. It is one of those afternoons. These little jobs, they just make more jobs. <laughs> so I got through on the number and they had to transfer me to somebody else who wasn't there. They're working random hours because of COVID. So I've got to try again tomorrow. <laughs> so that's just gone full circle. So I've made no progress whatsoever. And the Amazon seller about the slush puppy maker said, my files are too large. Can I resend them in a smaller format? So this is just going around in circles as well. <laughs> but I think I'll deal with that next because there's about 40 quid in that one for us. So I'd like to get that sorted. And I'm going to give it to Isabel because the slush puppy machine, which didn't work, was her Christmas present. And so that was a bit of a disappointment. But I'd like to just give her the money so she can choose what to buy with it. That was a long one. I counted 204 questions. I'm just going to quickly work out that percentage. Oh, there, that was a good one. Well done, Izzy. That must have been tedious. There was a lot of that. Pages of it. Pages. She can't wait to be done with maths forever so she can just focus on what she loves. Wow. Well, it's been a really boring day today and lots of things from today's list. I've gone right round the houses with them, making phone calls and emailing and they've just ended up being bounced onto tomorrow's list because they still haven't been resolved. Uh, anyway, what's the time? Half past five! So I'm going to go and practice my flute for an hour and I might go for a walk then because I've been staring at a screen for most of the day. <laughs> I need to not stare at the screen for a while. I'd like to do something physical and get some fresh air. And it's stopped raining now, so I'll probably do that. I might even cut my practice short to fit the walk in before getting dinner on. Maybe. If we can all last that long without food. It feels like a fridge down here. I'm sure it isn't like a fridge, but let's just see, shall we? Yeah, pretty chilly. Look at that. It's much warmer upstairs. I'm using my selfie light as an actual light. Problem with the selfie light is it makes me have like funny circle reflections in my glasses and they look like comedy googly eyes. So I tend to turn it against the wall and then have it bouncing back rather than actually using it. Wearing glasses can be a bit of a problem. <laughs> six in the evening now I kind of done three quarters of an hour of practice but kind of not I was getting very distracted I was kind of more interested in answering messages on my phone because you know you're not interested in doing your practice when you're more interested in your phone messages dinging in there we are though wasn't in the mood to do it in the first place but I did a bit I played through quite a few tunes that I'm supposed to be learning but I'm a bit hungry and I really really want to get out and have a walk in the fresh air before it gets dark <laughs> today so I'm going to cook a very quick tomato -y jollop with pasta for Izzy and I and then I'm going to eat it and then I'm going to go out for like I don't know a quick walk and then I'm going to come back and edit this so that's my plan. Here it is about half an hour later there's vegetarian mince in there with mushrooms and peppers and tomato passata and that's about it it's very simple just done some pasta with it so we're going to eat that and then I'm going out for a walk. I'm out all those birds. I 
interesting polyphony when you just stand under it and listen to all the different bird noises coming from all different directions. I don't quite know where I'm heading to, to be honest. It's a little bit late, it's half past eight, so the park might be closed actually. We're all right, look, we've got till nine o'clock. Let's see what the time is now. The time is 8.37, I really don't have very long, so I might just quickly walk around the duck pond and get back out so I don't get locked in. I've never been here this late before. It's pretty quiet, although I killed here the sound of a child just now, so perhaps they're making the most of the playground being open. Even the duck pond is quiet tonight, although there's like a flotilla of baby swans and bigger swans over there. Where are they geese? I don't know, let's see if I can get a closer look, but by the time I've got around there, they might have gone. Ooh, I think they've been hanging around here, don't you? <laughs> They're not swans. I couldn't see them before from the distance. That reminds me of when Izzy was a baby. I used to take her swimming and she'd drink half of the pool water. Found a lonesome duck. Is that she swimming? I'm just... Yeah, look, see. <laughs> I was following him with my zoom. Lovely flowers. I wish I could hang around and get lots of lovely shots, but I'm gonna have to just get a move on today, quick in and out. I like these ones better because, I don't know, I kind of like a lot of green with splashes of colour. That's more my thing. Seems like the park keeper scuppered my plans because there's another gate at the top here and I was just gonna go straight through it, you see but it's locked. So I'm gonna have to head back to the other gate that I came in, but I've still got time. If you like this video, please consider giving it a like because it really helps the channel to grow and I really appreciate it. If you're new to this channel and you'd like to follow more of our story, feel free to hit that subscribe button and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.